Today on Sports World with Bruce McAvaney, Grand Final Fever with the AFL Champions Crown. You've come back to the right place. Final special edition of Sports World with Bruce McAvaney. Feel the fever. And dare I say we do have a special program today. Good morning. Welcome everybody. It was a great day for Australian football yesterday. A stirring contest. A fantastic finish by the Adelaide Crows, a wonderful crowd. All in all, a very satisfying day. I guess not if you're buried for the Saints, but they've had a terrific season. So much to be proud of. We've got a lot of uh, experiments almost today. We're going live to Adelaide when the Crows arrive. We're going out to talk to Ray Hadley with 2UE at the football stadium as well and lots more. Kylie, good morning. How are you going over there? Yeah, very well, Bruce. Good morning. And good morning, everyone, from the Sports World News Desk. Well, if you've been living on another planet, you wouldn't know that the Adelaide Crows are this year's AFL premiers. They took the flag in front of just under 100,000 fans at the MCG in a match played in tremendous spirit. Darren Jarman and Shane Ellen kicked six and five goals respectively for the winners. Andrew McLeod was judged best on the ground and won the Norm Smith medal. The promise from the Saints was that they would do it for each other, that they would do it for Nicky Winmark. For Nicky no, Winmark. No. So many emotions, so much pain. Melbourne turned it on a perfect day for football. In enemy territory, the Crows got the jump, but without luck. Drills, hits the post. St Kilda steady, Heatley, two goals in as many minutes. Something special from Troy Bond on the boundary line to keep the Crows on track. It's right there, close, very close. Is it a goal? I think it is. You reckon that was good? Aussie Jones' length of the field run finished with something magical. But it was the Crows by two points at quarter time. Kicks it and gets it. What a goal. Make no mistake, this was classic grand final football. It was Barry Hall who cracked it open. Three goals in five minutes. The Saints by 13 points at half time. The third quarter is always the most important, and it was the Crows who stepped up. It was a danger zone for everyone at ground level, but it was in the air that Adelaide took control. Andrew McLeod and the genius of Darren Jarman. It didn't seem quite fitting for Nicky Winmar, but at three-quarter time, he must have sensed his fate. The Crows by ten points, they stormed home. Darren Jarman, the star, five goals in the last quarter. Jarman! Jarman! Yes! Darren Jarman! The heroes were many for Adelaide. Troy Bond, four goals. The Crows, a premiership in just their seventh season. St Kilda's 31-year wait continues. The script didn't end right for Winmar, but Adelaide has finally earned respect in Melbourne.